The Commonwealth Home Support Program is about making things easier for you and the 550,000 older people and carers you represent. Importantly, people receiving services under the existing programs will continue to receive the same level of support now and when the CHSP begins. There is change happening, um, but the change is evolutionary in aged care. This isn't a revolution, this is an evolution. It's a natural next step for us to be providing a more people-centred uh, service and program, and that's what the Commonwealth Home Support Program will achieve. I think at the moment the change is making some people anxious, and I think we just have to remember that there's really good design features that will enhance health outcomes. I think change is really exciting, um, particularly when you can see that things are being changed for the better um, and that things are being streamlined, you know, double handling, you know, duplication, all those sorts of things are being reduced. How can you not get excited about it <laughs> and be really keen about it and know that it's going to make a difference in your local community because basically that's why we do what we do. Well, I, I think one of the things we're looking forward to with the Home Support Program is that uh, first bit of entry. We often find that people come to us by chance uh, and they don't really have that ease of access into the aged care system and this, is, uh, this will provide people with that opportunity of um, really a one-stop shop of, of telling their story, explaining where they're at and what their needs are, whether that's short term or a bit longer, whether that's socialisation or whether that's um, support for carers. Um, those, all those suite of services are going to be available um, with, you know, via a website or via a phone call and I think that's, that's one of the best changes out of the home support program changes which uh, are coming our way. Put simply, the CHSP will benefit older people and carers through streamlined access to entry-level support services, a standardised national assessment process and entry point through My Aged Care, increased focus on wellness and reablement promoting equity and sustainability through a nationally consistent fees policy and reducing red tape for service providers through more streamlined funding arrangements. At ACH Group, for the last three to four years, we've focused on a good health approach, which is based on active service delivery, reablement, restoration, wellness and rehabilitation. And what we've found has been really interesting, particularly with our low-level HAC customers. For example, we've got a lady, a delightful lady, Rita, who uh, participated with an occupational therapy assessment and support and planning. And she loved gardening and because of problems with her wrist was unable to do that and generally finding it hard to manage at home and getting, I think she was getting a, a quite depressed. What we found was with an occupational therapy approach and having a splint and certain uh, gardening equipment changes, she was able to actually reconnect with her garden, which was a passion of hers and ultimately with other strategies that we put in place was actually a, a lot more positive and happier. So that was really heartening and it was a different approach that wouldn't have normally been offered with a plain uh, uh, traditional hack program. So, so similarly to what happened with Rita, we are really hopeful that once the Regional Assessment Service and the whole Commonwealth Home Support Program is rolled out, that we're going to see on a national basis older people like Rita have access to really good health outcomes, then that's going to really enhance people's quality of life through a restorative approach. Oh, I think it's, uh, it's an exciting time. Uh, we look forward to people being in more control of what happens for them. Um, ultimately, I see Novacare's role is to be a support to people to um, live their life and the, the Home Support Program um, prior to the Commonwealth will enable people, I think, to be more in control. Um, and I think that's um, there's synergies with what's going on in this program and what's also gone on in the PAC 
Linkage Program. It's just really supporting people to do what you and I would do and take for granted on a daily basis and I think that's really exciting. I think for all of us who um, face the prospect of ageing, it's an opportunity for us to build a better system for the future. Uh, that's what these aged care reforms are about, building a better system for older people now, but also having it right for future generations.